name is Gus. And I'm Woody. And we're instructors here at Sea Ventures, and we're going to be talking about the Shearwater Peregrine. We cannot wait to show you and tell you all about Shearwater's brand new Peregrine $450 computer. What a price point to get into the Shearwater computer world. So it tells you you can download the whole manual off the internet, but quick start guide. And let me tell you the funny part about the way Shearwaters work, they're so logical. I'm telling you that most people can turn this computer on and learn how to use it, I think in 15 minutes. That's just by playing with it. That's why iPhones don't come with a instructions manual, right? You can just figure it out as you use it. So I'm opening this. So look at what we have here. By the way, we just went live on Facebook. So for those of you just now tuning in, we have to do this over. I'm Woody. <laughs> and I'm Gus. Okay, so we are unveiling the Shearwater Peregrine computer here at Sea Ventures. We are a dealer. We were part of the secret beta testing team. We had the honor That's of right. testing it before. We weren't. We had to sign non-disclosures and all of that. I just showed the unveiling of it. By the way, I just wanted to mention, Woody, you mentioned the quick start guy. Um, you know, we've had ours for a while, but when you get yours, it's going to come with a wrap around it that would say Peregrine on it. Here's a little Easter egg. If you look the inside of the wrap, there will be a, a quick start guide written on the inside of it. Yeah. Which is pretty awesome. I've but never seen that like with another one. But it's got a little quick start guide that's, that's really nice. It's got a scan barcode yeah. so you can download the full manual. Also, you have a bungee that comes with it and you have a USB rechargeable cord. The bungee is a great idea because a lot of people now like to mount this on wrist slates. That's right. So that's really, really cool. Okay. Now I'm taking the baby out. Here she is. <laughs> Boom. It's awesome. Hopefully it'll focus. Give it a second, everybody. And I'm going to turn it slowly. It's trying to focus. The profile, first of all, it's really, really rigid. Like this thing, how Built solid like is tank. this? I mean, you can use it as a weapon, I think. And it's beautiful, just the size of it. But what I love is the clarity of how easy this thing is to see. So you peel off this sticker, okay? And as all shear waters, there's a button on both sides. These protrude out a little bit. So I'm just simply squeezing both buttons at the same time and I get a little feedback. Like it just gave me a little quick boop vibration. And there it is. Notice that mine is set in pink as all of my Shearwaters are. <laughs> you can customize the colors and it's really, really easy to use. One other thing I wanna tell is that mine says, and I don't know if it's focusing or not, but mine says 43 day surface interval. I have not recharged this. It came charged. It's still 100% battery power. That's right. And I actually have mine right here. Mine is a, a, a little bit different in terms of customization and stuff. One of the things that I did is I added this strap, which came from a Perdix. It doesn't come with the computer, but you know it, it works pretty awesome. And mine, when I turn mine on, same with you. I got it 40 something days ago. Or what's, it, it was charged 40 something days ago. I actually went diving this weekend and we'll talk about that. Uh, so it has a four day surface interval right now and it's still hundred percent charged. Amazing. After an hour and 40 minutes of diving. But you did good. bring up a good, a good point. So the strap that he has on, there's not the one it comes with. The one it comes That's with right. is in the box. It's wrapped around like this. So it comes with a really nice wrist strap, yep. right? You could wear this as a watch and Really, really. And it's sick. super long, so it fits over your dry suit, wet suit, doesn't matter how thick it is, that thing is gonna fit. Um, pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. On the bottom of the case, of the inside of the case, this is to me one of the best things they did, is this little recharger. Wireless charger pack. Wireless yeah. charger. By the way, I'm gonna plug it in. This will charge your iPhone. This will charge your Tarek. So this is the same kind of a charger that we use. You know, when you go away on vacation and you're like, oh man, I forgot my phone charger. Just bring this and you can charge everything in your room because honestly, the Peregrine has a 30 hour battery life on medium setting. And 
I keep it on medium setting because it's super 15, bright underwater. 15 hours of diving. So tracking everything while you're uh, diving in just one charge, 15 hours, which is awesome. So I'm just plugging it into a standard cube. I have a plug right over here. And once again, let's make sure that you guys hear what Woody said, which is the wireless charging for the Peregrine is the standard. I believe it's called Qi. Um, so you can charge your phone or you can charge the Peregrine on the charger that you use for your phone today. So it's not proprietary. And I'm gonna try to hold it up. It's, it's basically saying charge complete. So I have the charger on the back of the Peregrine, a little charger uh, light or whatever comes on Yep. and it starts charging. But as I said, okay, since my charge is complete on the Peregrine, oh, my phone is a little bit dead. So I'm just gonna stick my iPhone on it and boom, iPhone is charging. How awesome is that? That's so awesome. Oh, you know what else is low on battery? It's really not because even the Tarek lasts a long time. I use a lot of shear waters. This is the Tarek. Boom, I put that on there Char and charging as well. Right, Absolutely. so that's a really nice new charging device that they've made for the uh, for the Peregrine. And there's some other things that come with it, some stickers and so forth, typical of sheer water, and um, spare yeah. screen protectors. They give you comes two. already with one installed on the screen for you, which is great. That is, and nice. then they give you an extra one. And then finally, the only other thing I want to show them, Gus, is in the back underneath is a little toolkit. I don't know if you can see that. And how long did it take you to put the strap on? I mean, 30 Five, seconds. 30 seconds. It's nothing. Yeah. I'm not going to put mine on on this, but it's got a few little tools and pins to install it. And then how does it look on your wrist? Can you put that on? Yep. So one of the reasons why the, the, the elastic strap is because it's how easy it is to slide it in, as you can see. Um, pretty straightforward. Slide it in, tie it up, or extend it if you need more space because the, depending on the suit that you're wearing, but... Man, once it's on, thing doesn't move. It's and awesome. It's really nice. It's just yep. a good profile. It's thin, but it's really rigged. Okay, let's talk. Let's keep going down our points. Look, I wrote down a lot of points because I don't want to forget anything. This computer retails for four hundred fifty dollars. That Crazy. blows away any other Shearwater price computer. And I got to tell you, for the money, I mean, you're buying basically one of. I think it's one of the best computers ever made for right. the recreational diver. I yeah. really do. Absolutely. I mean, Shearwater is famous for having one of the best computers for technical diving, but that's not just because of the features that the computer comes with, but also because of the quality and the accuracy of the computer. So now with this one, you might not be getting everything that you need to be able to do technical diving, like Close. CCR mode or whatever it is, CCR, but you do get the quality and the accuracy of the actual device. And look, in general, the navigation of Shearwater. This is the same navigation functionality as every Shearwater. They're all consistent across all their computers. There's a left button push, and typically that brings you to different menus, and then you enter the menu or you enter the function select. with a right yeah. button push that says select. Like this one right now says on the right button, confirm. I'm just hitting the confirm button that I'm all the way charged. So I hit it, and that light warning me basically goes off. So super easy, intuitive navigation, I think is one of the things that Shearwater is known for. Now, I know Gus, you in particular have had amazing experience with oh their God. customer service. Tell them a little bit about Richard and Divetronics and just the surprises you get back when you send something to them. Yeah, Tell yeah, them yeah. about that. I mean, that one of the, the main reasons why I'm such a big fan of Shearwater is because their customer service is number one for me, not just in the dive industry, but in every industry that I'm, I'm a part of. I mean, it's unreal how good it is. Um, every time I send computers to Richard, um, Richard Morton out in, I think he's in Oregon or Seattle, uh, that area, Washington, Washington State, yeah. Um, I mean, I always get upgrades sent back. Last Here, time here's one, I, I, by the way, I just happened to send my Perdix back to him for some servicing. It came back, they, they know coloring, I love huh? pink. I get a nice pink bezel back. He's like, oh yeah, I did that for you. But that happens all the time. Yeah, it's unbelievable. I, I sent mine because 
while I was uh, I was diving, it ran out of battery, like kind of suddenly. I think it's because it was in the heat for a while. So I sent it back just so he can check it out. He opened it up, checked everything, came back. And I think he replaced the screen protector because my screen protector is always messed up. You know, I bumped that thing into stuff. He came and it was perfect. It looked brand new. So customer service, you just cannot get any better customer service Hands down. in the dive industry. Absolutely. Unbelievable. So that's who they handle all of the U.S. customer service. And you know what? It's likely you're going to speak with Richard directly. That's like right. He's going to respond to you via email directly. It's incredible customer service. Okay. Unbelievable. But in general, as all Shearwaters, it comes with a two-year warranty. Two-year warranty. So, okay. So let's get into a little bit of the use, okay? The yep. ease of use. So look, I'm hitting the left button. I just hit it once. Basically, when I hit it once, it says turn off, and then the, I would hit a right button and it would turn off. If I hit it again, left button, that's dive setup. So if I wanted to go into dive setup, I hit the right button. Now I have an NDL planner, right? Easy. So I would hit the right button. It says right on there on the right side, plan. So it's telling you what to do. If I hit it again, the next button, brightness. here's the brightness. It has an auto setting, so it'll change it. Depending on darkness and light. Okay, I hit it again. Yeah. What is this? Guts, I want you to talk about this next button. Yeah. The board so, vibration. What about that one, one? One of the biggest features about this computer is the vibration. Uh, if you're a diver, you know that when you're diving and computers start going off, you never know which one is it. You're looking at yours, you're looking at your buddies. Like no one knows what's going on. But with, vib with vibration, you will know it's yours for sure. And a lot of other people will know that there's a sheer water peregrine vibrating. Because I went uh, out with mine again to Pensacola this past weekend, I wore it on a dive and the vibration was so strong that I think they could feel it in like Cuba. I mean, that thing was Try insane. It. it was rattling the wreck. Um, it, was, it was unbelievable, the vibration that the computer comes with. And it has a, some pretty cool stuff, especially because I think that a lot of people considering a Peregrine are brand new divers or people that are looking forward to learn how to dive essentially in the near future. and you know, it has an alert system, for example, that if you get to a depth, which happened to me this last weekend, if you get to a depth where your NDL is five minutes, meaning you can be at that depth for five minutes, if you want to stay within your NDL limits, the computer will give me an alert. It will start vibrating, letting me know that, hey, at this depth, which for me was 100 feet, you only got five minutes and you have to head up because he thought I was doing air, uh, although I was on a CCR on a um, closed circuit rebreather. Not focusing. Okay, so so yep. basically the vibration mode is just an on and off. We were diving this week and I was a good 10, 15 yards away from Gus and I could feel the vibration. Yeah. Okay, so that was one of the functions under there. It has a great dive log. It can upload to the sheer water. It has a start Bluetooth. One of the things I love about all the sheer waters is any update that they come out with, you can literally Bluetooth into your iPhone. Yep. Put your iPhone near this shear water and it'll update the software automatically. Obviously also good for uploading your dive log into the Absolutely. shear water app. And they actually like that. They collect data when you do that. And they're always experimenting with deco models and so forth from us divers by uploading the logs. They do a lot sure. of that kind of research. Um, what else does it have? It has a system setup. System setup is a lot of different things. So. Under system setups, one of the things it allows you to do is um, several modes, air nitrox up to 40% nitrox, three gas nitrox up to 100% oxygen. Yep. So for those of you that are open circuit technical divers and going into deco diving, you may be carrying different gas, right? You have a deep gas, you have a shallow gas. Maybe you have a 50% O2 that you would switch to at 70 feet. Then when you get to your 20 feet uh, deco stop, you maybe you want to switch to 100% O2. Yep. Underwater, it's literally the click of a left button. It says, which gas do you want? Hit a right button and you select that gas. You turn the gases on in that system setup menu. Super, super quick Super easy, switching. super logical. So It's actually easier than some of the technical computers they have and Shearwater will actually be releasing those capabilities into the technical computers because of how easy they made it. It was already easy before, now they made it even easier with the Peregrine. Absolutely. Now, 
Some people want to know that it's got the trusted Bowman algorithm. So yep. that's the same that powers all of their computers. Yep. The nice part about it, we're not going to get into gradient factors on this conversation, but for some of you, that matters. You can change your M values. It comes pre-programmed with a 30, 70 gradient factor. A lot of people are switching to 40, 70, way outside this conversation, but I wanted to get it out there. That's really nice to be able to program that in yourself. So that's fantastic. Gus, tell them about, I think, one of the best features, which is this display. Yep, so when they approached us to be beta testers for the Peregrine a few months ago, you know, one of the concerns that I had is that because I knew the price point was going to be lower than their technical computers, you know, sometimes a third, depending on which computers you're, you know, you're looking at. Um, one of the things that I was concerned about is the quality of the screen, because I'm so used to the Perdix, which had a beautiful 2.2 inch display, LCD color display. There it is in focus now. Yep. So I was concerned about it. And then when I received it, I was blown away by the fact that they have the same screen, essentially 2.2 inches, full color LCD display. You know, Beautiful. it's so good. Other people actually, they shouldn't, but I'm, I'm not kidding you. They, they sometimes will look at our computers for the safety stuff. It's like they yeah. can see ours from a, you know, a good 10 feet away. I mean, it's super bright as you just saw when yeah. I held it up there and the camera had a chance to focus. And typically, you know this, if you're, if you're a new diver, right, when you see people with computers that are like that, that have that kind of screen, you're thinking about this is like super expensive, over a thousand dollar computer or whatever. Well, now $450 will get you the same screen that these top of the line, you know, computers give us essentially. Well, I'm trying to get it to focus again. Okay. So anyway, it's, it's an excellent. So we talked about the rechargeable batteries. They recently did a lot of changes on their rechargeable batteries. I'm telling you, at least on my Tarek, I'll go like three days of diving and come up and I still have 90% battery power. <laughs> this one on the Peregrine, they say is even better. So incredible. I already showed you the tiny little charger, simple, plugs in. It can be an iPhone charger. It can charge your other computer as well. So that's really cool. Okay, logbook capacity. By the way, if you wanted to get into logbook, left yep. click. It's all you do on all Shearwater's left click. It says dive logbook, right click. Then it display. says display on the right button. Just click display and that's it. You click next, left button typically on Shearwater's is the word next, right button is clicking into a feature, okay? So it's or exit it, right? I mean, amazing, amazing look of the log. It's really cool, but I wish this would focus. Just put it right on my face, I guess. Let me try it. I'm trying face recognition. my best. See, that worked. <laughs> is it focused? Well, you have the, the reflection, but yeah. All right, let me try it because I want you to see what the log entries of Shearwaters look like. Maybe Harrison can hold it close um, to the lens. Maybe you can hold it close to the lens. There you go. Well, there, there it you is, go. right there. Oh, okay, so what you see there is it's really cool. They always have a red line, which is your ceiling. So yeah. it'll show your dive profile in blue, and you can always see your entire dive so that you're never going above that red ceiling. Their log is oh, the amazing. best log of any computer I've ever seen. Peregrine gave me the same log functionality of all the Shearwater computers. You can see that one, the, the one that you're seeing right well, now. To the next is one. The, um, Let me click to the next one. If yeah. I want to go even further. Is the test. This one right here, you can show this one first. There we that go. That one is from an actual dive. So you can see like my max depth, how long the dive was. You can see a bunch of information, right, about the dive, the eco time, all that kind so of thing. So if you keep clicking the Harrison in the right button, it will say like next. It'll go like next. It'll go into the details of that dive. It'll show yeah. you water temperature. So just click that right button. The, the button. Yeah, there you go. Just click it and go it go further into the log. Yeah. Okay. Now go. look, it's showing you the water temperature of his dive. Um, a couple of things. A couple of other features. From back here, but it's hard to yeah. see from where we are, but. Very easy. He just clicked, right clicked further into it. Yeah. And um, anyway, extremely intuitive, easy to use pretty log. Awesome. So that's pretty awesome. Um, and it says it'll, it'll log up to 200 hours worth of dives. How about, oh, for cold water divers, for those of you using a dry suit, 
um, that vibration, that's who they thought about this for. It's going to vibrate right through that dry suit. It's a strong vibration, as for Gus sure. can, can attest to. Go through all the layers. Um, okay. Gus, let's talk a little bit more about some of its key features that we that we haven't talked about. Talk about the exceptional value. You're pretty aware of what computers cost out there, of the value now of 450 compared to what a new diver may Absolutely. be looking at. Yeah, I mean, I remember when I went through my open water and I wanted to buy a computer and I looked at all of these options that are all over a thousand dollars, right? And it really makes you think about like, I mean, it's not that I'm committed enough or that I can afford it, but will I actually use all the features in this computer? Now, I'm a firm believer that everything in life worth doing is, or, is worth overdoing. Side view. So I knew Take I was gonna overdo it. this thing and I ended up going with a Perdix. But in this case, you don't have to compromise. You can just go with something like a Peregrine, which gives you a lot of the features that the Perdix gives you, uh, will give you, but at a third of the price, right? Yeah. $450, that's Absolutely. huge. Absolutely, can you hold the, this is the Perdix he's holding up next to the Peregrine so you can see the comparison. Really the display is about the same size screen, yeah, and you can turn it on but perfectly. the Peregrine, this one, is the pair this no, that, one is the peregrine <laughs> you can see the display is about the same but it's much thinner it's a smaller the overall vessel the vessel of the vertex is it's just more, it's, more it has all it's all thicker. of those rivets and it, it's just bigger. and it also has a battery the the perdix the, the perdix has a removable battery yeah. removable battery, battery and this has a rechargeable battery yeah um okay so we talked about the screen resolution, full color LED. You can customize your colors, which I love. Yep. 5.59 centimeters, 2.2 inch display. Just for those of you that want to yep. know the details Same of that. Um, the weight, super light, grams. 122 grams. Yep. I mean, it's just a quarter of a pound, 0.27 of a pound. So that's nothing. That's nothing. Yep. Battery, rechargeable battery. We talked about that up to 30 hours on medium brightness. Um, air, okay. A topic that is all over the blogs yep. is air integration. Gus and I have had conversations about this when we were part of the beta testing. I was for them putting in air integration. Gus knows that. Yeah. Well, we Shearwater provided our feedback that. you mentioned. Right, that was yeah. feedback we gave. So let's talk about that. It's not air integrated. What does that mean? What Just does that mean? For those of you watching that don't, in uh, you know, might not be aware of air integration as a feature in computers because not all computers come with it. Obviously, as you shop around, you will see that some computers are integrated, some computers are not. So air integration, for everybody that may not know what it is, means that I could attach a transmitter to my stage one and it will send a signal to the computer so that you can read the PSI of your tank. The oh Peregrine God. does not have that. It's not air integrated. So I would rather it be air integrated, and I think Shearwater is planning on having that probably as a future upgrade on maybe a second edition of this. That would be awesome. I think they yeah. will, but the price is 450. So what's the big deal, Gus? What do you do if it's not air integrated? Yeah, I mean, you go the old school way, right? We use a submersible pressure gauge or SPG that will tell you how much air you have left, pretty much. Now, air integration is more than just telling you how much air you have left. Right, it can also read how fast you're breathing, how much time you have, you know, at the bottom based on that. So it gives you a lot more um, than just the, your air pressure. But look, you just get one of these little gauges. It just connects to your tank, right? And it just sits right there on your BC. Whenever you want to see how much air you have left, just look at it. And right? frankly, a lot of people are still old school and are comfortable having a direct connect into their stage one. Absolutely. Not everybody is comfortable yet with just having a pod transmitting air pressure. So there's a lot of people that actually carry an SPG even when they have a pod connected. So this was actually my deal. SPG. So even when I was air integrated, I carried this for, I don't know how many dives, maybe a couple dozen dives because I just thought as a backup, it will be good to know, to be able to default to this if it fails. But man, these computers don't fail. I mean, they no, no, just I've, work. I've never had one fail at all. Okay. Wireless data transfer technology, yes. We Absolutely. told you about that already. Um, it's a two button computer with 316 stainless steel buttons. That's just the grade of stainless steel. Let yeah. me summarize that in what you really care about. 
It's a friggin' tank, man. They are yeah. so solid. Harrison is holding. How does that thing feel? Seriously, your experience. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty. Pretty solid. That's a solid, <laughs> solid built computer. Right. Awesome. Okay, another big issue. Doesn't have a built-in compass. All right. the other shear rotors with a right button click, a digital compass will come up. That's right. This does not have a yep. compass. So if you want to have a compass, and Harrison, you can remove it for a second. Uh, if you want to have a compass with you, you're going to have to get a compass in addition to, you know, the pressure gauge that I was showing earlier. So now you're going to have this connected to your BC plus your compass if you really want that. Or, and that's why I brought my old, old one, you know, you may get an SPG that has air pressure and the compass and everything in one, but you're going to have to, you know, compromise essentially uh, because of the lack of air integration and compass on the actual computer. When you hold this up, this is the NDL planner. It does have an NDL planner, but it has an amazing NDL planner. Shearwater's NDL planning functionality, I think is best in the industry because it also has a deco planner. You can put in to this computer pretty much any variation. For example, let's say you have a true multi-level dive, meaning you have a task. The task means I'm going to go down to a certain depth for a known amount of time. I got to spend 30 minutes on 100 feet. Then I know I got to go up to 80 feet and do something else. It will plan at every one of those levels, including decompression. So it's really, awesome. really easy to use NDL planner. Um, I told you about the firmware update, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna click it over to the Bluetooth um, and maybe you can tell them a little bit about uh, how while that you're, works. While you're clicking on that, are there any questions, by the way, on the live stream? Because you guys can ask questions if you are on Facebook, uh, watching this, if you have any questions for us, this is live. And by the way, I just wanted to add, I know that we keep giving them like unending love to Shearwater. They're not paying us to review this computer right. uh, or to be beta testers. They just wanted our honest feedback as divers, uh, as dive instructors, essentially say what we, th what we thought about it, what would make it even better for our students. So Shearwater is not paying us to say nice things about the computer. We l literally just believe the things that we're saying, right? Because we've been using it and testing it for a while. Absolutely. I mean, it just is amazing. Okay, so. Um, you have to use the Shearwater app. Um, I'm not in the Shearwater app. What I'm trying okay, to show you, Gus is going to, yeah, go ahead. Gus is going to open up the Shearwater app. Yeah. And I've got the Bluetooth on. Okay, so I'm going to connect. He's going to turn it on. Yep, and so Peregrine. he's finding Peregrine. He's clicking on it. It says wait command. Yep. And now okay. I can download the dive. And he's downloading. So it's just as simple as I turned it on and it's sending a command to Gus's phone right now. It's downloading the dive or I could have chose update software. It was a simple, it was an update firmware. It was as simple as a left click. That's all I did was left click right there to hit start Bluetooth. I know it's not in focus. I hit left and then I simply hit right, boom. And it says initializing and, and it went and found his phone. It's yep. just sim super easy guys to use this computer as all of them are. Oh, languages, Gus, what languages does this thing come in? Yeah, I mean, it comes with uh, support for English, French, German, Portuguese, Korean, Japanese, Italian, Spanish, and uh, simplified Chinese and traditional Chinese. So a bunch of languages, just bunch like the other computers. Easy to change the languages and system setup. No yep. big deal there. The wrist strap I told you about, <clears throat> super simple. I mean, the wrist strap just, you know, on the Peregrine, there's just two little holes. You put it right like I'm trying to show you. You stick it in there. You stick a, the pin that comes with it yep. right through the two little holes. Uh, you do the same thing on the other and side. They, they did an awesome job, the by the side. way, with the pins because typically pin watch, Maybe the, you can the watches. Maybe up and show them the holes the, the in the pins strap. pins in watches are like, they have like a, like a, um, you know, recoil and you have to like be really uh, meticulous with it. Not with this one. It's just you just shove the you shove the little yeah, pin pin through it, screw it with the with, on the other side. You know, comes that's with, it. Right. So it's just these little pins. Uh, here, I'll, maybe, I'll do one really quick so uh, I can he, see it while yeah, you talk about something one. else. Okay, here it is. You can, you can go ahead and matter of fact, put my straps on would be nice. It's so easy to do. <laughs> right. So easy, very rugged uh, wrist strap. 
Um, okay. Oh, by the way, optional add-ons. I just found out about wrist strap colors in ocean blue and white. Mm -hmm. If you wanted that, that's kind of cool. I like all the different colors. And um, also, this the final thing I want to say about it in general is this computer is going to last you. It's going to grow with you. You as a recreational diver can grow with this computer pretty much to any recreational, any non-CCR mode you're going to go to. If you're going to become or you already are a closed circuit rebreather diver, it does not have a CCR mode. That's where you would go into the Pernix, the Taric, or the Petrol, but you're talking about more than double the price, right? Yeah. So for $450, this is now my new absolute favorite recreational dive computer. That's awesome. So let me tell you a little bit about us at Sea Ventures. We are a dealer of many computers. We are taking pre-orders on the Peregrine. So here we go. Pre-orders, if you order this by five o'clock this Friday, where's the phone number? Where's our phone number is 770-992-3772. We have a limited quantity of these Peregrines we can get. There's and not a whole you, lot of them out there. Not a whole lot. It's really popular. It's going to go really, really fast. If you do that by 5 o'clock Friday, call us, 770-992-3772. You're going to get this very cool shirt. I breathe underwater. What is your superpower? Or one of our awesome Sea Ventures water bottles. water bottles. But more importantly, we are a Shearwater dealer. So you're buying it from an authorized dealer and um, you're going to love it. You're not going to have a problem reading it. One thing for me that's always a question I get from new divers. What dive computer should I get first? I get that question on almost every class. Yeah. I tell them typically two things that I care about. Can you see it underwater is my number one thing. Can you read your dive computer? Number two, how easy is it to use? I mean, do you really, you should read the manual, but you don't want to have to memorize a ton of different button functionality. This is a two button simple navigation, including the navigation underwater. Can you see it? Is it easy to use? And then you get the power of sheer water on top of it. You'll never go back again. $450 by this Friday at five o'clock. If you call us at 770-992-3772, Sea Ventures, there's our website, seaventures.com. You will get what I think is a very cool shirt. Awesome. Yeah. I breathe underwater. What is your superpower or our free water bottle? We are super proud to have been selected by Shearwater. I want to shout out to them. Thank Absolutely. you. That was a big honor. We do a host a podcast called Dive Talk. You can find it on divetalkmedia.com. I have every Shearwater computer there is. You almost do. Yeah, I'm only missing the Tarek, but I mean, it's, it's um, yeah, we're, we're huge fans uh, of Shearwater. So thank you, Shearwater, for allowing us to do this. I think you guys hit it out of the ballpark for $450, boy. And I think that that's why we wanted to do this live stream as well, is that, you know, when a computer, a brand new computer comes out, you'll see a lot of people talking about it just based on what was announced by the company who made it. Whoever, whoever company it is, um, you'll see it, you know, the people are like, oh my God, you should buy this computer, it's awesome, before they even have their hands on it. We've had our hands on this thing for a while. I a couple of months, it, yeah, really. You know, took it diving, erased it, you know, reprogrammed it again, you know, install every single, you know, strap on it, wear it, let me see how it feels. And that is when we felt confident enough to come and talk to you guys about it and recommend it. Yeah, I mean, just so you know, do people like it? because that's another thing you may want to know, well, what do other people think of it? They pre-released or they released on the day they announced it, 2,000 of them, they were gone in the first hour because those people that are familiar with Shearwater, that wanted to 
backup computer or maybe a computer for a family member, yeah. they already had such amazing experiences with Shearwaters that they jumped on this. They cannot believe it's a $450 computer. Yeah. I'm telling you, hard to beat. And, and by the way, uh, this doesn't mean that the other computers that are out in the market are not useful or you shouldn't buy those. Uh, you know, we we have several computers here. Like, if we let me grab this one with you. Sure. Right there. Okay. So this is an Aqualong i550. You know, what I really like about this computer is that if you really like to have something connected to your tank, you don't like that wireless technology that the shear waters depend on, and well, the Predagreen doesn't even come with it. You know, this thing is awesome. It has the compass, the air integration, the it has everything in one super compact piece. Now, this is a little bit more expensive. It will cost you, you know, $250, $300 more than the Peregrine, but you don't have to install an SPG and a compass and all of that. It comes all together with one. So you really want to think about, do I want to have just one computer that I look for and, and it has everything I need, or can I do a Peregrine with an SPG and a compass? Will I feel better with that? You know, it's, it's a personal preference kind of thing. I think that by the time you buy the other stuff, the Compass, the SPG, and all of that stuff, then, you know, you pretty much get to the price of one of these that is fully integrated as well. Yeah, and, and I, that's a, it's a good point, really, to talk about in general here at Sea Ventures. Yeah. Our staff, guys, they are really, really good about walking you through all the different computers and all of the different options. They're yeah. going to do that with the Peregrine as well. We even have computer classes. Some people want to really take a specialty class of course, we're at SSI uh, Instruction Center, and you can take a class just on computers. So um, you've got a great knowledge base here that'll really walk you through all the different options of, we've got computers all the way up to a very, very high level, including the um, Sunto, Sunto Eon Core, Eon, Eon. Yep. right? That even does have a, a CCR mode, but price point here. So what's the price on a Sunto Eon Core fully loaded with the transponder. $1,350. How much? $1,350. With the, with with the, the, with the pod? Yeah. So about 1300 bucks. Triple the price, but obviously triple the capabilities in some cases, right? Yeah. Air integration, all that stuff. So there's so many options in the market, and that's why it's so important that you reach out to us, the Sea Venture, and, and we can talk about what are the things that you're looking to do and make the best recommendation. We want you to be safe and have a computer, right? A computer is a absolutely needed piece of equipment, whether it is a, a Shearwater Peregrine or a Perdix or one of these Aqualongs, doesn't matter what it is that you pick as long as you have one and you're safe. Yep, and if you're thinking about a total dive system, right? BCD, absolutely. regulator, boy, this makes for a heck of an addition to that total dive oh system. God. So oh. I think what we're summarizing here and trying to say is, for $450, right? I wanna put it in perspective. You're now getting into the Shearwater computer world, which are considered at least one of the best overall computers in the world. Yeah. It'll grow with you for a long time. Hold it up one last time. I have it on my pink setting. Any then, questions, uh, by the way, on the stream? Let, if you can, so look. you can see the clarity there. No, no questions, questions right. guys. Reach out to us. We're going to end by telling you the phone number is 770-992-3772. Thank you. See you on the next one. See you on the next one. <laughs> That's it. Bye, everybody. Beautiful. Yes, we're back. And the reason we're back, everybody, is we understand there were questions. And I apologize, we apologize, we didn't know. So we're answering the questions now. Um, colors was one of the questions. What yeah, colors? I'll, I'll ask you the question. Okay, so, I'll ask the question. So Randy Shaw had a, a, a few questions. Hey, Randy. And I want to just answer all these questions uh, combined. So the first one is, how does the compass on the Perdix compare to the basic one we showed? This right. one. And follow-up question to that. Is it worth to get the Perdix with a compass rather than the Peregrine with an extra compass? All right, listen. The compass on a Perdix, it is excellent. It is a simple right click of a button and you get a very accurate digital compass. But I want to put it in perspective. The pricing of the Peregrine is $450.
the Perdix with a compass is about $1,200. So in essence, you would be paying about $750 you can have mine for, for a compass. So what I will tell you is it's okay. not a big deal. I always carry a magnetic compass with me anyway. So you save a lot of money. Yeah. I don't think it's worth it if your decision point is buy a Peregrine without a compass or a Perdix with a compass, easy. Buy a Peregrine. You That's wouldn't, my you wouldn't want to upgrade from a Peregrine to a Perdix just for the compass. There's no a way. bunch of other features that you would want to upgrade for, but the compass is not one. That's right. Okay, yeah. what's the next question? Next one. Do you miss having audible warnings since the Peregrine is vibration only? Ah, the Peregrine is vibration only and audible or both. You can turn audible on. The reason Shearwater did this, they told us about this, was because some people are annoyed by the audible, right? You hear everybody's dive computer, so they're giving you the option for vibration. Also, Shearwater caters to a lot of cold water divers that want to be able to feel a vibration through a dry seat. So you absolutely can turn on in system setup. You just left click and then right click on system setup, and you turn on the audible feature. So you can have all those options turned on. And Randy, to be honest, once you get the Peregrine and that thing vibrates, it will be audible around 100 feet around you. Oh, yeah. Uh, that thing vibrates so loud yeah. that it will be vibration and audible, just with vibration only. And you could turn these audible and vibration modes on for various different things. Yeah. Maybe it's your safety stop. Maybe it's when you reach a certain depth whatever you can program it in the system setup what you want the alarms to go off for very very easy navigation on the paragraph yep next question from randy was what screen colors are available for customization i'll tell you which one is not available you look them up if you want to orange my favorite color is so, not one of them however the screen is capable of displaying all of the colors because what it is. So you, we, you can change the welcome screen with a picture and it will display a picture like your cell phone display yeah that's, right. that's really cool so but it does all the colors but white blue kind of a magneta and pink is the standards magenta. i believe that's magenta yeah me. so those are the four it's like four um, or five yeah whatever color you do pick and then it has a blue bezel on the outside and behind. super bright right here. yeah the blue is also behind um, it's the I, only one that comes and by the way i've, in, I've installed the strap now you can see that that took gus while i was talking a matter of 30 seconds to put the strap on it comes with the tools to do it or you could mount this to a wrist slate it comes with a bungee i showed that a little bit earlier okay what else? um let me see randy yeah i think that's it um all the questions from randy we got a shout out from Daniel. Said I strongly recommend Shear Water and Sea Ventures. So, thank you, Daniel Ray. And like I said, here at Sea Ventures, we are a dealer in a lot of computers. Gus said it very well. We love all of our computers. Yep. Sea Ventures, a 30-year business. They don't carry a product that they don't believe is going to be great for our customers. It's just against the owner's philosophy. They want to know whatever they carry that vendor is gonna back you. Yep. But now, they are telling you they are very proud to be able to sell you the Peregrine. And again, I'll remind you, if you buy it by Friday, close of business Friday, let's say around five o'clock, you will get either water bottle, water or, bottle or, which is pretty awesome team, by the way, my favorite one. I love this Still one. Super excited to get the uh, I breathe underwater, what is your, super power and we offer computer classes don't forget we are a full ssi shop so we have a computer class we have a deep class we have all the uh, ssi classes available but they will show you their staff is well trained on the computers so a lot of the things you may ask different questions once you come in and see the computers in front of you they're going to know the bells and whistles with all of them Woody's thing is, can I see it, and how easy is, is it to use? And for $450, this is no less way. than half the price of any other Shearwater computer you're gonna get. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, Daniel Ray also asked early, though, on the uh, broadcast, if you could get it with AI. We talked about that later on, so we kind of mentioned that. Well, but, and the answer is, not, not yet. yet, but their standard procedure, when the Perdix first came out, it did not come out with AI. 
I bet you that will be a next generation of the Peregrine, but they're trying to keep this at a $450 price point for a sheer water. And that's the whole concept is, wow, what a great backup computer, what a great first computer, what a great computer for a family member. For so sure. keep, keep in mind that's Or with an SPG, concept. I mean, you dive with that, plus a SPG, yeah. you're good to go. You're good to go. It's not, it's not that bad. Uh, and then finally, Doug Eversole. Congratulating us for a good Doug. job. Doug! Doug is watching. Thank My you mentor. so much. Who I love. I hope you're watching. We're tuning in. <laughs> Going tape uh, diving with you all next week. But that is all the questions. That is all the so questions. So any other questions you have, call us 770-992-3772. We're proud to be instructors here at Sea Ventures. Thank you again, Shearwater, for making us part of your secret beta testers. And uh, thanks for tuning in. Thanks, guys.